All right, let's talk about a fascinating way to eat that might just be a game changer for your health. It's called the autophagy lunch, and it's all about tricking your body into a deep cleaning mode. So what is autophagy? Picture this. Your body is like a busy city. Over time, junk starts to pile up in the streets. Old damaged cells, misfolded proteins, just general cellular gunk. Autophagy is the city's sanitation crew. It comes in, sweeps up all that junk and recycles it for energy or to build new healthy parts. It's your body's natural detox and repair system, and it's crucial for slowing down aging and preventing diseases. Now, how do we turn this system on? The most well-known way is fasting. When you stop eating, your body senses a lack of nutrients and flips the autophagy switch. But let's be real. Fasting for long periods isn't easy or practical for everyone. This is where the autophagy lunch comes in. It's a clever hack based on something called a low-carb, low-protein, or LCLP diet. The goal is to mimic the effects of fasting without actually starving yourself. The secret lies in understanding how our bodies respond to different nutrients, a process called nutrient signaling. Think of it like this. Two main nutrients tell your body, hey, we've got plenty of building blocks, no need to recycle anything. Those nutrients are carbohydrates, which spike insulin and protein, which activates a pathway called mTOR. Both insulin and mTOR are powerful signals that switch off autophagy. They tell your cells to grow and divide, not to clean up. So the autophagy lunch is designed to keep both of these signals quiet. It's a meal that's very low in protein and very low in carbs, but high in healthy fats. Why fat? Because fat has a minimal impact on both insulin and the mTOR pathway. It provides your body with clean energy without turning off that crucial cleanup crew. So what does this lunch look like? It's not a big steak or a chicken salad. Instead, think of things like a large avocado with olive oil and a sprinkle of salt, or maybe a big salad of leafy greens and cucumbers, drenched in a high-quality olive oil dressing, but with no protein source like chicken or chickpeas. You could even have some olives or a small handful of macadamia nuts, which are super high in fat and low in protein. By eating a meal like this in the middle of the day, you're essentially extending your overnight fast. Your body gets energy from the fat, so you don't feel deprived, but because the protein and carb signals are absent, it thinks it's still in a fasting state. This allows autophagy to continue running for several more hours, doing its cleanup magic. It's a simple, powerful strategy to give your cells a much-needed break and a chance to rejuvenate, all without having to skip a meal. Give it a try and see how you feel.